So the question comes up, is the stethoscope a vector for transmission of infections? We know the hands are, so it makes sense that the stethoscope must be a transmission, uh, a vector for transmission of infections. And actually there have been studies that have shown that both the density as well as the diversity of pathogens that are on a stethoscope are exactly the same as they are on a hand, right? So now you've got another vector besides your hands that can transmit infections from patient to patient.